opposite at the Philippine Adderoy and the Sassent is widely and greatly helped the individuals and Philippine grandmother is now reincentivated and reborn from the internet and uh, except one of those that immoralized uh, that Philippine bad boy. Oh my god. Oh, that's been difficult, the heartbreaking. The team cleaned up the bloody crime scene. Looks like the bloody whole mess to the whole place in the room. That is the tragedy and called his aunt, who then called the police. The victim was... I have uh, my auntie's uncle and grandpa still. ...was found with wounds on her neck, chest, head, and arms. Oh my god. Police officers also found blood-stained ceramic shards of what appeared to be a smashed vase in a garbage bin in the front yard. The grandmother, who had raised the boy since early childhood on her own, was killed because the boy wanted to play a video game. Moral of the story, never hurt the, with your own grandmothers. Let's get to keep the mock that the Philippine boy to teach and I to get to learn a lesson and teaching any lesson. And, uh, and it shows the morals of who they are. That is totally is not okay. The murders is by the own family. No, it's not okay. South Korean man Lee Seon Soap wasn't just an avid player of. That's not. That's not even the image. The, this is a video errors right there. That is not supposed to look like a, look like the hands as, as even actors. He's one of a <clears throat> he's one of a famous the South Korean actors but all the time. But you have to fix it. You have to fix it, the image that's showing the display or the video footage. Is, this was a video errors right there. of StarCraft. He was addicted to it. He let the popular real-time strategy game take control over his entire life. In 2005, he started... The Asian people that really like the StarCraft, there's a popular hit in the game franchise. It's still the bright their day. And other than that, uh, I really uh, played the, uh, you know, Command and Conquer. Spending all of his time playing the game, which cost him his job and longtime girlfriend. Lee would spend almost all of his money in an internet cafe. Just don't waste the money to don't go into the video game addictions, otherwise it's, it's getting worse. It's business make things worse. Uh, you, you can't do it to take so long to sit in front of computers, man. FA to play it. He was used to playing 14 to 18 hour sessions. Maybe it's a 30 minute straight. 30 minute straight. Not takes an hour. But when he started a 50 hour session, that was the end of his gaming day. Yep. Yep, he did. At the end, he collapsed and died from exhaustion and. That's the video errors, a wrong image. Dehydration. When it comes to games, there's a difference between healthy enthusiasm and an unhealthy addiction. In this case, like the similar to Nico Aquaquado, but David Gershon doesn't like the I love cheese. But uh, David Gershon likes the healthier, like I like Aquaquado much better. And that's why I'm singing, singing this, singing with the voice girls. Ace, the man's love for StarCraft consumed him. Perhaps we incinerated the inside the internet. And he's came into the StarCraft universe. <laughs> Looks like the StarCraft, the shared universe that our internet world games are, are all over the whole place. And I have a wonder of wonders that I've got uh, the story written. Uh, this this might be have to make this big stream stream play because all those have the people that as games addictions it still has freaking messed up. I'll have to the creating the characters' stories about uh, what works happening. 
day, it has the same fate of the real person. 17-year-old Warren LeBlanc of Leicestershire, England, got life in prison for emulating a death scene in a video game in 2004. The game in question? Manhunt. The game was developed up to by Rockstar North, armed with a knife and a claw hammer. I think this will Leo Casper to banish from the uh, Daniel Mines, but it's now the, he's, uh, he's been the born from the darkness the, back in the few years, the 2006. Maybe, uh, maybe it's a, uh, he, he's been we born to the born from the darkness and back into 2001. I think it's, uh, it's actually it's a course. Warren lured 14-year-old Stefan Pakira to a nearby park. He bludgeoned and stabbed the boy over 50 times. Oh wow, look at that. This, I, would, I wonder if this that to the oh, oh, wonder if this, the people this woman attentions are all night there. They, they might have the having is that some people turns the bad and the insanity to the commit the crime here of the murders, the massacre, the shooters, homicide, vandalism, auto theft, and stealing, and then all that stuff. It's just still going to crap things happen, this, but this year it's an up and down side, so over 2023. It's just not, not even to have the bad people that are necessary to go into the has the all of the all of the uh, society to make to feel a bit emotional the issue. So if you the if you just uh, if you just seen bad people to the turn to the insanity to the going insane the psychopathic and it affects. So if there's a people to who contact the nice night this weekend to do still turns out to be they are bad on murders. And they going to sink and and going to killing the innocent people like a the, like a like a Mike massacre, the alter ego of Michael Morrison from the damaged Amiga games. And I and I don't don't think that any of this a the crimes against the humanity to turn to insanity to the insane their has murdering to the every each of the bad people to turn to pure evil so which is the people that have shocked and has put in a restraining the owner to the to cash them the criminals is this like a 10,000 people that are criminals of them if they are so wonders have uh, Michael's Evan uh, uh, Michaels is going to reading the article and investigate the evidence and research about to the, commit the crime, said it, commit the criminals that act in our manhunt murders is out there. This is wonders, uh, wonders of a hunter would have to say to never go out to any witch hunts or manhunt murders and a basis that they like to commit a crime of murders. But they went to they went to the insane thing. They should have put it like the as I put the insane asylum at the mental hospitals. And they should have to put the learn learn a lesson and and then so the back the years and I feel bad for her. the Thai people victims. Former the police officer he turns insanity and he did the shot the school shooting massacre. That's just terrible things. That's just terrible to shock that I have seen. And I feel bad for the Thai people, families, the children that fell to the heartbreaking a lot. So boys and girls today. If, if this is a bad people that everyone says, if this is a bad boy, is it's a bad people that's trying to message to you, just immediately block them, ignore them, just stay away from them, and be sure to stay, stay safety. And make sure you have to do not go out any mad on murders 
otherwise they